We are back with our special series, Celebrating Service. And this morning, it's a special one. We are honoring National Teacher Appreciation Day. Yeah, and Jen has made her way down to Brenham, Texas, with a teacher whose greatest lesson is never giving up. Hi, Jenna. Good morning. Hi, hi, morning, guys. I cannot wait to introduce you to Mrs. Smith. Wanda has an incredible journey. She grew up here in Brenham, always hoping to return here to teach and after a long and difficult journey, she did just that. When I stand in front of my classroom, that, that in itself, my classroom, I am living my dream. Teaching has never been just a job for Wanda Smith. And why does it need space? It's her life purpose and her greatest accomplishment. We're gonna go with the pineapple. And not one that came easy. You graduated from high school and your dreams, you were going to be a teacher but life had a different path. My plans were to go straight into college, but then my mother got sick. And so those dreams had to be deferred and I just got a job and started providing for the family. She couldn't stay away from the place that felt like home. Mrs. Smith worked around the clock as a bus monitor and a custodian for the Brenham School District while caring for her family. You were working like crazy yes. hours. I was working three to 11 at night for custodians. I would get up at six o'clock in the morning to be a bus monitor. Sometimes I didn't get to sleep. I never really thought about it. I just did it because it had to be done. Years later, she became a teacher's assistant and decided it was time to give her dream a shot. At the age of 37, Wanda enrolled at a nearby college. Were you nervous about going back to school? Yes, I was totally nervous because all of the children in there they were children, and sometimes I was older than the professor. Taking classes at night, she pushed through, but not without some setbacks along the way, facing incredible personal loss. I lost my mom, my sisters, in my journey. But you kept going. I was so happy to tell them that I was going back to school. They were so proud of me. My sister would be the one I would talk to at night when I was coming home. Then when I lost her, that took a lot out of me. And yes, I did want to stop. But my husband, he sat me down and he let me know that I wasn't the only one that made sacrifices. And so I was like, okay, I can do this. I can keep going. Her husband, Darren, and their three kids supported her each step of the way. Ten years later, Wanda Smith, joined the graduating class of 2010. Wanda Diane Smith. I got a diploma. I mean, somebody growing up in the projects that people counted out. I got a diploma. Mrs. Smith became a first grade teacher at Brenham Elementary, the same school she once cleaned. Wanda Smith is the portrait of an American teacher, and she's such an inspiration to us all. In the last year, as so many struggled during the pandemic, Mrs. Smith stepped up when her kids needed her the most. You started delivering packets to some of your kids' mailboxes. A lot of my kids are from single-parent homes. So when my parents would call me, because I was checking in with them, and they would say, well, Miss Smith, you know, I got to work. Well, I'd be like, OK, give me your address. It was nothing, because we have to help one another. Her perseverance and dedication, one of the greatest lessons for her students. She's the best teacher ever. She helps us with everything. I want them to know that school, these are going to be the best years of your life. And I want them to love school enough that they want to come and see me every day. And if they love me like that, they're going to come and see me every day. Mrs. Smith, I know that you think we are here just to talk about teaching during the pandemic, but it is Teacher Appreciation Day. And we want to let you know that we appreciate you. And there's some others that want to do that, too. So walk with me. Watch your step. What do you think about watching your journey on, on TV? It was great. <laughs> it was you great. Did it, did it. <laughs> <laughs> your student. Oh, Come on. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> it's so hard not to hug you, Mrs. Smith. <laughs> okay, walk. 
walk with me, walk with me. These are all your kids. They love you. They love you so much. And so they are your first surprise and probably your best, but let's stop right here because we got some more. Oh, God. <laughs> Mrs. Smith, step back just a little. Carson I want to introduce good, right? you uh, to <laughs> Dr. Alyssa White. She's the president of Sam Houston State University. Dr. White, what do you got? I'm excited. So, Wanda, you're an inspiration to us all. And on behalf of Sam Houston State University, <laughs> We've created a scholarship in your honor. It is the Wanda Smith Make a Difference Scholarship that will go to a Sam Houston State University first generation student who wants a career in teaching. Congratulations on your accomplishment. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, but that ain't it. Let's keep going. Sorry, I know I shouldn't use bad grammar in front of Mrs. Smith, but this is the mayor of Brenham. Mayor Tate, you've got something too. Yeah. Wanda, you're not just an inspiration to your students, but also to our community. And in that regards, I would like to, as mayor of the city of Brenham, declare today, May 4th, 2021, be the best you can be, Wanda Smith Day. <laughs> we thank you for your service to our community and school. I got a day. Today is Wanda day. Smith Day! That's pretty cool. Could you ever have imagined no, never. going to school here never. that one day you'd have a day named after you? A day named after you. Oh. I think you need more than a day, but we, that's not it. Here's our final thing. Here's our final thing. I think you know your principal, Principal Rokey, who has something for you. Miss Smith, you inspire us more than you know. Your dedication to children for being nice and working hard every single day, for going above and beyond, we thank you. Congratulations, and we love you. A bitch for your school, for you. And there's three people behind bench. that bench, three oh, people kids. behind that bench who love you so very much. Oh your husband, Darren, and your two kids. <laughs> what do you, you want to, you can give them a hug. You want to? And kids, if you want to come over, come on over. Oh. Oh. <laughs> 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 and here are all your kids, <laughs> Mrs. Smith. Uh, we know that your that your one regret is that your mom and sisters weren't here, but we know that they are looking down. So very, very proud of you today and every day. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. All right, guys. That's about. We need all the Kleenexes in the world. <laughs> so my send it back to you. Yes. Mrs. Smith. Thank you, guys. Oh, wow. Mrs. Smith. Oh, <laughs> Mrs. Okay. Hoda, I, Hoda. Yes. I'm, Hoda, I told Mrs. Smith yeah. that you have been really looking forward to meeting her. Uh. And she's been looking forward to meeting you, too. Well, Mrs. Smith, I mean, we're so happy to have Wanda Smith Appreciation Day. It should be every day. And you're going to come back and join us again um, on the fourth hour. We love you so much. That was the most beautiful, beautiful tribute to a beautiful educator. We got another surprise or two up our sleeve for later, all right? Man. Oh. You know there are folks watching right now who are so inspired by her. To God be the glory. Yes. To God be the glory. Yeah, the story just came back around. Yes, Never thought the day would happen. I know, isn't it awesome? It's awesome. Thank oh, you so oh, much, guys. Awesome. We'll have more. It's beautiful. Uh, Hoda and I in the in the ten o'clock hour. Thank all right. you all. We love you. Thank love you, Jenna. Probably named our own Mrs. Smith. Oh. Yeah. Who inspired us and pushed us on like? Oh my gosh. Oh, Boy, that was that was. I mean, yeah. I expected an amazing story. I don't know if I was prepared for well, that. I think in the, yeah. over the last year, our teachers have gone above uh, and beyond, oh, so it yeah. was just yeah. appropriate for us to recognize someone who, like Wanda Smith, my goodness. Mm. Wow. Uh. You know, every time she's in her classroom, her dream is coming. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. That's beautiful. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.